guys, this is Alvin I'm with Raquel and we at Asonis. Yeah, we're hanging out today enjoying the view. Right in front of us we have a yellow water taxi <laughs> on the lake. It's really nice, it's really cool. It's not that hot, at least not yet. Right now it's 11.30 and we just walking and enjoying our time in Okay. <laughs> so they have a vegan restaurant right off the water here. It's called Stella Rose Real Taste. Um, I hear that the food is good. Never had it. <laughs> but the scenery is nice. I like the outside atmosphere. You know, just a plain white building. It's nice. Look at this guy, he's about to play dominoes. He's waiting for his uh, <laughs> opponent. So we're here at this restaurant, Casa Sensei, <laughs> Pan-Asian Latin Fusion restaurant. And this is their menu. Um, there's a lot to choose from, a whole lot. Soup and salad, um, Latino bites, small plates, dim sum, which is pork, um, dumpling, veggie, you know, all that stuff, noodles, pan thai, pan ki, muha, Crispy tofu. They have a lot of things. They have Korean barbecue. On this side, they have shrimp curry. And the prices is not too bad. As you can see, the, these are the prices right beside um, the food. Um, it's a lot to choose from. So we'll let you guys know if the food is good. We've been here before, like what Elvin was saying. We've been here before. It's just that now it's different. Before it was all Asian. It was just an Asian restaurant, but now it's a mixture of Asian and Latin food. So I'm not sure what I'm going to get yet. And on the back side of the menu, they also have a wide variety of alcohol to choose from, all these other different things. They also have a brunch menu. Um, we still have quite a few things to choose from also. So there's endless things to, you know, if you're feeling for, whatever you're feeling for, they really do have it because they do have a lot of things. So this is the blue crab rangoon. For four, um, you get only four for ten dollars. 
but it tastes really good and it's a good size so they're really good it's not enough because it's only four but it's good so that means it's two for me and two for elvin mm, I, I could eat all four of them so but it tastes really good <laughs> So this one is the shrimp dumpling, but they actually call it shamai. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that properly, but it's part of the um, the dumpling um, section of the menu. But this is shrimp, and they're tiny. You see how tiny they are? And this is also ten dollars, <laughs> and you get five. <laughs> so let's bite into it and see what it tastes like. How it tastes, what flavors you get. Shrimp. Sure. A lot of fishy taste. It's just fishy and the sauce is not sweet or anything like that. I assume this is um what's the name of that sauce? It's not duck sauce, what's the other one? Soy sauce. Soya sauce. Yeah, because it's not sweet or anything. So this is my um meal that I got. It's the sensei fried rice. They have pork and shrimp in there. You can see, and then eggs and beans. So this is the shrimp and this is the pork. So it's a good amount. It was $19 for it. And you get a good amount in there. I don't know the taste yet, so I'm gonna taste it to see how good it is. And I like the presentation. I like the, I guess this is a cucumber. <laughs> I like the cucumber that's standing up in the plate. It's a nice presentation. So let's see. It's hot, so I'm not trying to burn my tongue, so I'm gonna blow. <laughs> it's well seasoned, the pork is well seasoned. So that's a plus. Shrimps are a little bit small. I wish they were a little bit bigger. <laughs> so this is Elvin food. We have sesame chicken with bok chow and rice underneath. Um, it looks really good. Um, jasmine rice underneath the sesame chicken and with bok chow on there. This was $20 too, right? This is $20, $19. Yeah, and string beans. Don't forget the string beans on top. <laughs> You'll let me know and let you guys know what it tastes like. <laughs> Would you like it? Yeah, actually it's yeah. pretty good. It's really good. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> That's good, Elvin. Would I come here and eat this again? <laughs> yes. Okay, well, there you go. It looks good. And I had a little piece of his sesame chicken and it's very good. A few moments later, this is not happening. Anymore. A lot of cutting to do right here. I got a little piece of vegetable off. <laughs> so I guess complimentary um, dessert is a bowl of sugar. They give you cotton candy. <laughs>
I don't eat cotton candy, but you know, it's here for whosoever do eat cotton candy when you come, if you visit this restaurant. This is what you get, um, like a little freebie cotton candy. Elvin, you gonna eat any? No, you're good? I said I'm gonna, I'm gonna bring it home for the kids. I don't know if they'll eat it. I don't want to waste it, so I'll bring it home to see if the kids will eat it. And the food was pretty good. Um, the portion is not a lot, but the meal is good. Like, um, it's a little bit pricey, but it tastes good. Like Elvin food, he really likes his food. I like my food. Um, we're gonna bring home a, a little bit of it because we couldn't finish it, so. But like the appetizers and stuff like that, you're only getting four and you're paying $10. The meals are $20 with a bigger portion. So obviously the meal work out better than these little appetizers that you're getting. Because we for the dumpling, we paid um, $10 for the dumpling and you get five small little dumplings. <laughs> and for the blue crab, um, one ton, that was $10 for four. So definitely the meals are the best choice if you come and you know if you, know, if you, if you could skip the appetizers, skip the appetizers and just order your meal because it's a better deal when you get your meal opposing to the appetizers, if you know what I mean. <laughs> all right guys, see you all at the next stop, which is across the street. We're going to go um, get dessert. It's a cookie place or was it, um, oh, pastry. Bakery. It's a bakery. bakery? bakery so they have all different different type of pastries so we'll see you guys when we get there Oatmeal cookies with chocolate in there, right? Well, we'll find out what it is. Which one? This one? Oh, look at these. Yeah. Definitely want to try these. Yeah. Looks like there's almonds in there. It might be pistachios. Yeah. And these strawberries. No, I'm more like this cinnamon swirl. Yeah, that looks yummy. Oh, we are getting the wedding cake. Look at these over here. Yeah, I wish they had the name tags on these.
I can look at this. I can look at these. I didn't even notice these right here. They look like too much sugar for me though. Look, look at these over here. I don't know what type of cake that is. Yeah, this is really easy. Uh, what's the name of these cookies down here with the chocolate dr uh, drizzle on them? Okay, so this one is the strawberry cheesecake croissant. So this one was I think $3.29 or something like that, which that's not bad. Because it's a good size. It's a good size. So we have that one. And then we have this one. Alright. Yeah, they do seal it up really, really well. <laughs> This one. Oh, okay, so this one is a little lemon um, pie. We have all the little cookies in this one. So I'm going to taste this one. I haven't had this for what? How long have we been here? So when was the last time we were here? Like five years ago? Probably. Yeah, it's been a long time. But I remember having this one. I don't remember anything else, but I remember this one. So I'm gonna eat one of this on camera. Because, you know, this was my favorite. <laughs> Let's see if it tastes the same way. To me it does. I'm gonna open and taste these. It's not that sweet, you know? It's almost like a biscotti, but not as hard. So it's almond and like powdered sugar and like it's a little bit doughy on the inside. It's good. Probably good in the morning with coffee and stuff like that. Because like I said, it's not that sweet. It looked like it would be sweet, but it's not. And I don't like sweet things, so that's why I like this one. All right, guys, thank you. thank you for watching. Thumbs up the video if you like what you see. And if you're not a subscriber, subscribe to the channel. Please subscribe, support, and thank you. And we'll see you in the next one. Bye.